Hi folks, Chris Voss here from thechrisvossshow.com, thechrisvossshow.com. Come to the blog post I want to share with you. This is a, an amazing backpack bag that's made by TomBin.com. That's TomBin.com. There'll be a link below the video. You can take and click on. <clears throat> this is one of the most coolest, well-built backpacks made for the iPad and iPad 2 that I've seen in a long time. This is called the Rosetto, or Ristretto, I should say, for iPad and iPad 2, the Rist. Reto, there'll be a link below the video, and uh, <clears throat> in essence, it came with. Uh, I don't know if this comes with every iPad bag order, but they sent a wonderful envelope that's got a beautiful feltish type. I'm not sure what material this is, but nice feltish type uh, screen cleaner for your uh, iPad, which is really nice to have considering the fingerprint issues you get. So that's nice that they sent that along. This is. Uh, the Ristretto, of course, for the iPad 2. Let's take a look at it. Um, now, one thing you notice, it's got a clasp here that clasps very tight. I'm pretty amazed at some of the build of this product, so we're going to go through this. Now, what this is, you can see there's uh, a backpack, uh, shoulder strap sort of thing you can have here. It easily attaches, of course, to the backpack. You can move it if you just want to hold this as something uh, that's even got a handle across the top where you can just carry this. Um, on its own if you don't want to have the big backpack or shoulder pack. It even has a wrap around this area that is designed I suppose for you know, whatever you want to take and use it for. I don't know if you get it around your waist you might be able to um, or if you want to attach it to something else. It's all even got some other handles that are here that you could use for whatever you want and on the back it's got a giant pouch for whatever you want to put in the back area. We'll get to some of the rest of it here but um, it's pretty amazing on how well built it is, how sturdy the feel of it is. Um, what this has got on it, it's got a built-in com uh, padded compartment specifically designed for the iPad and the iPad 2. It's very huge. I can almost put a giant towel in this thing. It's crazy. Uh, the exterior is made of US 1050 denier ballistic nylon, twice the abrasive resistance of most denier fabrics. So what you're going to get is this has got some abrasive resistance to it where it's not going to get scarred, not going to get torn as much. Uh, it's really going to have to work hard to achieve that. It's uh, The padded compartments in it have open cell foam laminated with durable 4-ply Tasian and uh, the interior has soft brushed tricot protects from all sides. Um, it's lined with ultra weight yet uh, tough Dyneema nylon rip stop fabric and uh, it's got of course the handle on the back and of course two shoulder straps and uh, overall it weighs about a pound which is really nice uh, and what's really cool is it's uh, made in the USA so you can't beat that when it comes to being made in the USA so let's take a look at this some more I really want you to take a look at the hooks here that they're using you can see how well this is made this isn't cheap in any way um, all of the sewing, all of the bindings, everything just looks really well built and not some cheap junk that you're going to get like in China, etc, etc. So, um, and, and, and it looks very small when you first see this, but when you open it up, you're going to see what I'm talking about. So let's go ahead and open it up here. Now inside, this is what you're going to see. It's got the fold out flap and it even has a QR code for, for their website. But in here, you can take a look. There's a place for your iPad that's back in here. And it's even got like a little fold-over protector that uh, will protect your iPad from sliding around, sliding out. But you can see it's got a huge amount of room in here. Immense. I mean, I can almost get half of a towel down in here. And it goes way down. You can see how far my arm is going down. I was going to test this out by shoving a giant towel in it to see how you could see what you could put in it. Uh, you could actually put multiple iPads really in here. Um, they make other bags also for your MacBook Airs all the way up to 13, uh, which is really cool. And then they've got a front area here, <clears throat> and this is a whole other giant expansive area. Now here's what's really cool about the Tony Bin bags. They have these really cool pockets and toys and things that you can get. Uh, what this comes with is, this is attached inside, and you can of course release this if you don't want it. But what it is, is basically an area where you can store just about anything you want to store and also you want to protect it. So when you open this up, you can see in here, there's several different felt areas 
that are separated for protection. You could put your phones in here. You put other things that you don't want scratched up in here. Uh, this is a great compartment to hold these. Now you can of course unattach this and attach it anywhere on the device if you want or remove it if you wanted to, but it's a great pouch that you can have that safely uh, protects whatever is put in here and put inside the case. So pretty amazing that way. The space in here is just immense and it feels wonderful. It feels very protective. It's something that's not going to scar up your iPad, which is very important. Now I want you to take a look at something else here. <clears throat> See the design of this zipper? The design of the zipper basically, they have a cover around the zipper where the zipper is not exposed. That's probably really important, especially in cases of spill, etc. etc. So, we're going to go and open this <clears throat> front area that we have here. And in the front area, you're going to see we have a whole nother very large area of several inches. I mean, I probably could shove a whole giant towel in this thing. And we've got another one of these great little pocket things that's in the front area. And this, of course, has an attachment device where we can attach to different things here. You can open up the zipper this. It's got a nice felt interior in there. You could use this to put money in. Uh, you could use it to put your phone or any other things that you want protected and covered. And those easily go inside the bag. You can also see that we have several pockets in here, pens for pens or uh, whatever else, calculators you might want to put in here. This is an awesome bag if you're a student or if you're someone who does traveling because you're easily going to get this, of course, through uh, security and airport. Uh, but this would be a great carry-on backpack for all of your essential items that you could probably get in here if you're doing like a day travel or something of that nature. And you can put your iPad in here. Where you go, you've got everything. You could almost use this as a giant purse the way it's designed. Um, because <laughs> it's definitely got everything. You can put your credit cards in something like this or the other thing that's inside the backpack. It really is a well-made, beautiful backpack. And uh, you can just really tell with the feel of it, the way it's designed, the way it's cut, the quality of material that goes into it. Looks like this is the shoulder pad, and there's a bit of like a rubberized grip here across the shoulder pad. So it's not going to slide around on you as much. Very well thought out product and completely adjustable looks like in a lot of different ways for given the size that you're at. I'm really impressed with the quality of the backpack. It's made in the USA which you can't beat and it looks like they put a lot of thought, quality and care into the backpack. Plus it's going to protect your iPad and some of your other computer elements. You likely could get a smaller notepad, uh, notebook in here, a laptop in here also with your iPad and probably numerous other devices if you have them. Um, you could, I, I mean, maybe you wouldn't want to put two iPads back to back, maybe if they have covers or maybe you could put one in one compartment, one in the other. You could easily put a lot of stuff in this backpack. So be sure to check it out. It's basically called the Wrist Reto from Tom bin.com. It's tombin.com. The wrist reto for iPad and iPad 2. Check it out. I'm really impressed.